Confession. <laughs> I post pictures. Anytime I get close to a nice car or a nice house, I snap with them. I rarely go to club, but you see them scattered on my page. That picture you see online, how it filters, they are not actually my face. I post jokes that you don't even know when I'm sad inside. That DP is with a picture that smile. But sometimes I'm hot. It's a By disguise. Chance. By chance, if somebody treat me out on a nice meal and chicken tie, instead of me enjoying the moment, I'm too busy taking pictures for the purpose of people online. Why? I do all this because I see my friends online doing fine, and I don't want them to think I'm behind. Even when I'm starving, my last card go for the latest clothes. Ha! Ha! Should I be on flick? They got to see us when we land to the show. Oh, in house trends, but um, uh, we are still using the latest iPhone. <laughs> Spraying money at the party. Even even at the last cash, I do give away with the last card. Borrow wigs and shoes for photo shoots. So when they see the look, they gotta say pain. When I post on Facebook, damn. They gotta say you the man. With many likes and comments, with all these lies and nonsense. Is he giving me the happiness and comfort that I want? Thinking about it deeply, it's not. So playing to social media and society, I'm done. Making you think 100% I'm living well, but otherwise I'm living in hell. Trying to please people that don't really care and otherwise I'm hurting myself. Too cheap, I place myself online as a product to sell. And what I get back is a currency of comments, likes and share. And that is worthless. Comparing that value to me, I undersold. That value is valueless. The truth is, you can't attain happiness if you use your friends' lives online to set a standard for yourself. You are different from them. Walk in your lane. Is there a need for that contest? Overtaking is allowed though, since they know they close the express. Sometimes, when you feel down and tired, pack your car aside and take a bed rest. Break away from the prison of what people should expect. I'm not saying you shouldn't aim for the best, but content and debunk the notion that you are less, less blessed. blessed. Taking myself as shit, taking my opinion above what people think, and that strange comment online doesn't actually define me. I'm done putting anybody's thought above my dream, breaking away from the prison of poor people should see. I just want to be free, not bothered about how many followers online. And on YouTube, I don't even want to mind. Checking views, attaching my happiness to how many people listen to my rhymes. Fearing the fact that this spoken word might not be accepted, deleting some lines that I wrote dearly to my heart. I'm done forming to be strong when I should break down and cry. I'm done feeling cool and matured when I should burst into laugh. I'm now moving forward at my pace. Never mind if someone else is fast. I'm done being scared of showing off my work because you believe it's shitty doing this petty stuff i'm done with the fear of meeting up failing to do what i love i'm done expecting good always preparing for the wars i'm done going for perfection now i'm accepting my flaws and it's time i tell you that our relationship online all while has been odd it's not about you it's all my fault now it's time for me to fix up so it's high time i tell you that i'm done and thanks for the experience, the journey and more. Now, I have an amazing new life lined up. Peace.